summer is winding down, but the e-scooter business might not be for at least one company. Cold weather won't bring a halt to Roll's participation in the city's pilot project. You know, our aim is not to um, like provide this for tourists, but we also want to make this um, a you know mode of transportation for people to go get groceries, for essential uh, things, and you know uh, all other. We want to use scooters as a mode of transportation, basically. So that's why we want to operate all year round to make it um, you know accessible and available during all seasons. The company plans to reapply for a permit in April. There was a lot of restrictions uh, in the beginning, and I know one company um, had to leave uh, because they said it's uh, operationally and financially not viable. Um, we invested a lot of um, uh, we invested our time and effort to implement new technologies to make sure we're providing a safe uh, safe mode of transportation um, to also comply with the new requirements as well as some of the pieces were really hard to manage at some point. Uh, so permit fines and uh, some other fee pieces were a little bit financially challenging, but if you look at the overall picture, it's a viable, op uh, viable market financially. While Bird pulled out halfway through the summer, saying it was no longer operationally tenable nor economically viable, Roll and Lime stuck with Kelowna. Proud to report that residents and visitors to the city of Kelowna have taken more than 150,000 trips since launching this year and covering more than 280 kilometers, which is really impressive. Um, so just going forward, I mean, we are dedicated to partnering with Kelowna uh, and its goal of providing affordable, reliable, and safe transportation for all residents. And we believe, you know, our operations dem demonstrate this dedication and we look forward to work closely with the city to meet its goals. She couldn't say if Lime will operate through the winter, but will definitely keep scooters on the streets through the fall. 2022 will be the final year of the city's e-scooter pilot project. In Kelowna, Cindy White, Castanet.